Caesar. I'm strangled on bubble gum cloud. Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh, your mama could call me Saint Nicholas. <laughs> So you know how we do, how we start this bitch off. Hey, get my drink a drink on. To all the killers and the hundred dollar billers. Mm. This one, you know, do a toast to the ones that didn't make it through 2019. The ones that didn't make it to 2020. To you, you toast. Put on a liquor for you. I drink my shit. This next one, all the pedophiles <laughs> and the snitches that's sitting in prison, that getting their asshole blew out. This is for you. Guard that booty hole, nigga. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck you. Oh. The good shit. Santa's already fucked up. I came in this bitch. Hide in a giraffe ass. Oh, this one is for Jesus. This one is for Satan. Like I said before, there is no darkness without light, and there is no light without darkness. Mm. It's that 90 proof. <coughs> that good, good. <coughs> Damn. Everybody. Again. <laughs> this is that good, good. I know the alcohol won't solve most of my problems, but it's worth a shot. <laughs> or read an article about fathers and sons drinking together. I remember the time I took my daughter out for her first drink. Off we went to a local bar, two blocks away, Christmas Eve. I got her a Guinness. She didn't like it, so I drank it. I got her a Heineken. She didn't like that neither, so I drank it. I got her a Bud Light. She didn't like it, so I drank that. Then I figured maybe she liked whiskey better than beer. So we tried some Jamesons. Nope. In desperation, I had to give her some Hennessy. Best liquor. The good good. She wouldn't even drink that either. She wouldn't even smell it. What could I do? I drunk it. By the time I realized she just didn't like the drink, I was so shit-faced, I could hardly push her stroller back home. <laughs> On Christmas morning, a boy wrote to Santa Claus talking about, please send me a sister. Santa wrote back, okay, send me your mama. <laughs> <laughs> There's a plane going down over the desert Christmas Eve with only three parachutes on board. There's four passengers though on board. The smartest man in the world, the best doctor in the world, an old priest and a young nerd. The doctor says, people need me for my medical skills. He grabs the per first parachute pack and he jumps. <laughs> the smartest man in the world. He says, people need me for my intelligence. So he grabs a pack and he jumps. The old priest says, you know what? I've lived a long and happy life. You take the last shoe. The nurse says, don't worry about it. There's enough shoes for both of us. The smartest man in the world took my backpack. <laughs> said I went to the doctors with a problem. Doctor says, what seems to be the problem? Santa says, I seem to have an apple pie stuck up my ass. The doctor says, well, you're in luck because I've got just the cream for that. <laughs> <laughs> the nurse at the sperm bank asked Santa if he'd like to masturbate in the cup. He says, well, I'm pretty good, 
but I don't think I'm ready to compete just yet. <laughs> <laughs> a man comes home from work, Christmas Eve. He sat down in his favorite chair, turned on the TV, and he says to his wife, quick, bring me a beer before it starts. She looks at him a little puzzled, but she brought him a beer anyway. When he finished it, he said, quick, bring me another one. It's about to start. <laughs> this time, she looked a little angry. She brought my beer anyway. When it was gone, he said, quick, another beer. It's going to start any second. She stops and says, that's it. You bastard. You walk in here, flop your fat ass down. Don't even say hello to me. And then expect me to run around like a fucking slave. You won't even realize that I cook and I clean, I wash and I iron all day in this motherfucker. The husband says, oh shit. It started. <laughs> hose, hose, hose. Where's my money? <laughs> if you see me smiling, it's because I'm thinking about doing something naughty or evil. If you see me laughing, it's because I've already done it. <laughs> oh. Nigga. Oh. A mafia son sits at his desk writing a Christmas list to Jesus. He first writes, Dear baby Jesus, I've been a good boy the whole year, so I want to know. He looks at it, he crumbles it up, and he throws it away. He gets a new piece of paper, and he writes again. Dear baby Jesus, I have been a good boy for most of the year, so I want a new... He again crumbles it up and he throws it away. He then gets an idea. He goes into his mother's room, takes a statue of the Virgin Mary, puts it in the closet and locks the door. He takes another piece of paper and he writes, Dear baby Jesus, if you ever want to see your mother again, <laughs> Oh, you like that? Three men die on Christmas Eve and they go to heaven where they're met by St. Peter's. In order to get in, he tells them, you must each produce something representative of the holidays. The first man digs in his pocket and he pulls out a match and he lights it. This represents a candle of hope. Impressed, Peter lets them in. The second man pulls out a Tangle the keys and shakes them. These are bells. He's allowed in too. So, Peter says to the third man, what do you have? The third man probably shows him a pair of red panties. What are these gonna do with Christmas? Peter says, they're carols. <laughs> <laughs> a pedophile Santa lures a group of Houston Girl Scouts with, hey girls, would you like some candy? <laughs> they all agree, and he follow them to the North Pole. There, he offers them some more candy, and he follow them to his house. Once again, he offers them candy, and he follow them to the living room. As he leads them up the stairs, one of the girls looks at the other one, and she says, God, I hope we get laid before we get diabetes. <laughs> <laughs> Two older ladies were heard chatting over lunch. One says to the other, So, Harold brought me a dozen long stem roses home last night. You know what that means. I'm going to be spending all Christmas with my legs in the air. The other lady ponders this for a moment. And she finally says, Why? Don't you have a vase? <laughs> What did a perverse Santa say to his victim? Go ahead, call the police. We'll see who comes first. <laughs> <laughs> on Christmas morning, a cop on horseback is sitting at the traffic light. And next to him is a kid on his brand new bike. The cop says to the kid, nice bike you got there. Did Santa bring that to you? The kid says, yeah. The cop says, well, next year, you tell Santa to put a tail light on that bike. The cop then get a kid a $20 bicycle safety violation ticket. 
And before the cop ride off, the boy says, By the way, that's a nice horse you got. Did Santa bring that to you? Humor in the kid, the cop says, Yeah, he sure did. The kid says, Well, next year, you tell Santa to put the dick underneath the horse, not on top. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a joke to tell your kids, since I'm telling all this dirty shit. Why do seagulls fly over the sea? Because if they flew over the bay, they'd be bagels. <laughs> <laughs> a sweet and innocent young Italian girl gets married, and a girl's mother lives downstairs. The girl has never made love to a man before, and on their wedding night, when he takes off his shirt, she goes running downstairs. Mama, mama, I, I can't believe it. He has hair all over his chest. What should I do? <laughs> the mother's making spaghetti sauce. She's stirring the sauce thoughtfully and she says, hair on his chest? He's your husband. It's your wedding night. Go upstairs. She goes upstairs. The man takes off his pants. This is her running back downstairs to her mama. Mama, mama, he has hair all over his legs. What should I do? The mother stirs the sauce thoughtfully and says, Hear his legs? He's your husband. It's your wedding night. Go upstairs. The girl goes back upstairs and the man takes off his shoes and socks. She looks down at him and sees that half of one of his feet is missing. She goes crying back downstairs to her mama. Mama, mama, he's got a foot and a half. What should I do? The mother hands her daughter a spoon and says, A foot and a half? Here, you stir the sauce. I'll go upstairs. I'm swinging on a clown. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year's. Fuck all y'all. We out of here. Peace. Drop.